What's up dogs? I've got a new toy to play with today. I've got a little review sample of something from a speaker brand called Acoustic Energy. They're British brand of speakers. This is just going to be a super quick unboxing. I'll try and make it fun, I'll try and make it interesting, put some interesting camera angles in, maybe, yeah, trusty unboxing knife, you know. If anyone is wondering, you're probably not. I did used to do some reenacting, so that explains why I've got loads of swords. Doesn't explain why, I, why I'm using it to unbox this. But it does amuse me. Right, so like I said, Acoustic Energy are a British company and these are a pair of stereo, like mini stereo powered speakers and sub. I believe they're Bluetooth as well. Uh, I haven't got anything like that myself, so it's going to be quite interesting to review them. I think these are going to work really well with the turntable, which is how I'm going to try and push them to you. I'm going to do two or three videos. One of them is just going to be a general review where I use them in my room, replacing my big studio monitors, because it'd be nice to see what it's like having all that desk, desk space. Uh, and the other one is, like I said, it's going to be with a turntable, probably with the dual turntable I've got my hands on at the minute. But if I can grab a phono stage, borrow a phono stage off someone, I'll probably try it with my big project turntable table, just to see how it sounds. Oh, and I'll do the Bluetooth bit, obviously. So you get some instruction manual. Hopefully this is all in focus. We've got some phono cables, presumably, for attaching the speakers to each other. Wow, these are tiny. Consider it. This box is massive, it must be the sub. They're really nice actually, it's really well made. It's uh, it's quite a stylish chrome metal look to it. Weighty as well considering they're, they are really, really small. Got, sorry the lights are right in the way of it there. Acoustic energy on the front of it. Again, was that, pl oh, that bit's plastic but the outer chassis is Aluminium, I'm guessing, and the back is rubberized so that they sit quite nicely wherever you put them. I really like them. Ooh. So, uh, one phono jock in the back, Ego or Ejo? Ejo? Ego? Ego 3? Something like that. We have one optical cable, we have mini jack to mini jack, so you can plug in, I don't know, phone, laptop, any of your sources. We have power cables. That's the one I'll need. Wow, right. Didn't anticipate the sub being quite so big on this, actually. We need a remote. Nice, well made, seems. It's plastic, but nice and, nice and petite. I'd probably lose it down the sofa, but we'll try not to do that. So that's the subwoofer. It obviously isn't quite the same build quality of the two satellite speakers. It's all plastic. Yeah, plastic grill. It's everything you get in the box. The Ego 3s here are a set of 2.1 Bluetooth speakers, one large sub in the center, and you've got your two satellite speakers to the side. In total, they handle 65 watts of power and cost at retail around £199 UK. If you'd like to buy a set of these, check the link down below. The full review will be coming in a few weeks, like I said. If you want to see more great Audio Llama content, click on the links to the left and to the right and click on the lamb's face to subscribe.